Most of you might be familiar with the words eclipse and apocalypse and might have seen some eclipses in real life. Now, picture this. The world plunges into darkness. The air is filled with an eerie stillness and an otherworldly phenomenon unfolds right before our eyes. Welcome to the ultimate face-off, eclipse versus apocalypse. Well, let's understand the difference between these two first. Eclipses are of two types, solar and lunar. A solar eclipse occurs when the moon passes between the Earth and the sun, blocking all or part of the sun's light. This celestial alignment creates a captivating astronomical event. The moon's shadow, known as the umbra, casts a temporary darkness on Earth as it moves across the sun. Total solar eclipses, where the sun is completely obscured, reveal the sun's outer atmosphere, the corona, in a breathtaking display. Partial and annular eclipses occur when the moon covers only a portion of the sun. These events have fascinated cultures throughout history, inspiring myths and scientific exploration. Observing safety precautions, such as solar viewing glasses, is crucial to protect one's eyes during these awe-inspiring moments in the sky. The second type of eclipse is the lunar eclipse, which occurs when the Earth comes directly between the Sun and the Moon, causing the Earth's shadow to cast on the Moon. This celestial event unfolds during a full Moon, with the three celestial bodies aligning in a straight line. As the Moon enters Earth's shadow, it undergoes a captivating transformation, transitioning from its usual radiant glow to various shades of copper or red. This phenomenon, known as the Blood Moon, results from the Earth's atmosphere-bending sunlight around the planet and onto the moon. Lunar eclipses are awe-inspiring celestial spectacles that have captivated human curiosity for centuries, marking moments of celestial alignment and offering a reminder of the intricate dance of the cosmos. On the other hand, an apocalypse is a cataclysmic event that imagines the end of the world as we know it, a terrifying thought, yet undeniably intriguing. The concept of an apocalypse has fascinated humanity for ages. It represents our curiosity about what lies beyond our control and our desire to challenge the limits of our understanding. From terrifying natural disasters to zombie outbreaks and alien invasions, the apocalypse takes many forms. But why does this grim and terrifying idea continue to grip our collective consciousness? The concept of an apocalypse touches upon our survival instincts and motivates us to reflect upon our lives, values, and the fragility of our existence. It's a catalyst for personal growth and societal introspection. So, whether it's witnessing the celestial harmony of a solar eclipse or imagining the chaos and rebirth that an apocalypse brings, both offer us an opportunity to contemplate our place in this vast universe. In the end, the eclipse and the apocalypse share a common purpose to remind us of the grandeur and unpredictability of life. So, should we fear these tantalizing phenomena? No. Embrace them as reminders that our world, though ever-changing, never ceases to amaze. Thanks for joining us on this cosmic roller coaster. If you enjoyed our exploration of eclipses and apocalypses, smash that like button and share your thoughts in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe for more mind-expanding content. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring, and keep looking up.